So the last few days, it's been kind of big news that the University of Malta is now offering a blockchain and distributed ledger technology master's degree. Now, I actually think that this is super cool and has a lot of really positive ramifications for the crypto space. So let's dig into it. Hey guys, this is Leah for a crypto news update. Now, Joshua Lul, who is the director of this master's program, in addition to being the chairman of the Malta Digital Innovation Authority, told Coindesk that they really wanted to create this program to help fit a need in the market and help blockchain professionals to be specialized, but also to be just a little bit more well-rounded. He said that there are blockchain professionals that are experts in certain sectors of the industry, but few could really tie all these strands together. For example, coders may not know much about the legal ramifications of things happening in blockchain, just like lawyers might not know much about coding. Now, I think this is actually a really smart move for the University of Malta, and I mean, what better place to launch a program like this um, but even more so I think that it's really smart for the space now yes if there's anything you want to learn about blockchain or cryptocurrency or cryptography like you can find that information somewhere somehow but there are certain benefits to having it involved in formalized education now I'm gonna start out by saying that I think this is kind of smart because old school industries trust old school industries and as blockchain continues to grow and expand and become an undeniable force in our world these huge companies are going to be developing their blockchain strategies and departments and looking for qualified people to work and to help them and to contract for them and so even if you could talk circles around anyone else about blockchain technology i have a feeling that people that have some sort of credentialed education in blockchain technology are going to have a little bit of a leg up for some of that work because these bigger institutions are so used to trusting looking at some sort of formalized education as a form of credential. Now think about it, when computers came out and people started being exposed to the wonderful world of email, there weren't necessarily an abundance of computer science or information technology programs on campuses. Now a program like that is pretty much a staple in every college. Heck, I even have a bachelor's degree in information technology. But what's really cool about how the tech industry has evolved and how I bet it's going to be very similar for crypto is that whether you have a formalized tech education or you're self-taught, you can still earn a very good wage from your knowledge set and from your skills. And so I have a feeling that crypto is going to be very similar. And so there are going to be pros to partaking in some of these more formalized education type of settings by having certain credentials that will help you to kind of build your credibility in the space. But I also think that there are going to be so many other ways to build your skill set on your own, to be self-taught, to build your credibility without needing some sort of higher education. And so much like the tech industry has really been open to both paths, I think that crypto will be as well. The point is that I think that the University of Malta is starting a trend and one that I think is really positive. And I hope that we see more campuses offering blockchain and cryptography courses. And, you know, maybe beyond courses, maybe they start offering it as a minor so someone can get an IT degree with a minor in cryptocurrency and blockchain tech. And then maybe eventually there's more full-fledged degree programs. Because let's face it, as much as we might think that the current education system is antiquated in so many ways, and God knows how much money people are spending to go get an education, it's still a pillar of society in so many ways and is something that a lot of people are obviously still doing and attending and a lot of employers are still really valuing and so these kids are going to be there just learning a bunch of stuff anyway like how cool it would be for them to be able to actually take classes that will give them a leading edge on things that are really happening in the real world because as this space progresses and blockchain technology becomes even more just invasive into our everyday lives and, to, and really starts to touch every industry, having a knowledge of cryptocurrency is really going to set those people apart. And if it hasn't yet, it certainly will be as the space continues to grow. So let me know what you think. I'm super excited to see what happens here with the University of Malta, how this program goes, and how other colleges begin to respond and begin to start offering even more courses 
courses and program offerings on their own campuses. So let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think that cryptocurrency classes at the college level is going to become a growing trend? And do you think that is a good thing? So if you like my content and you want to see my face more often, then you know hit subscribe and we can hang out. And I will see you guys in the comment section below.